All right, 1,000 UC. Let's check out this brand new crate. So they added this lucky crate, which I'll probably open the 40 times so I can get one legendary. This is not my favorite like PUBG Mobile Esports skin. Um, I kind of like the pan, like it's it's kind of cool with the dragon around it. It's kind of cool, but I really just, I'm not a fan of these skins for the uh, esports stuff right now. They do have some crazy skins sometimes, but this time around, not a fan of it. There's a lot of crates. I mean, it's kind of crazy. I think it's because it's the anniversary. It's the fifth anniversary. This, this crate right here, I've never seen anything like this before. And I wanted to get my luck meter all the way up and see what happens when you get your luck meter up. 6.5% chance for legendary. All the legendary items um, are there, including engine cores, which I'm pretty sure if you click on workshop supplies, you see where engine cores originally were used, which are like the first ever upgradable car that has eight levels. So I, I don't understand why they added this into the game. It's Halloween and Christmas skins. It's so random. Maybe it's because it's the fifth anniversary. But I want to see how easy it is to get these skins, so let's uh, let's give it a try. Dang, my screen glitched out there for a second. What the heck? I got the hand cam to prove it. It wasn't even... Okay, so... oh, we got something. Oh, so does that legendary count towards the luck meter? Each opening is 540 UC. I got some discounts, so 500 UC. I'm just really curious how easy it is to get one of those special vehicles, because those are like the original upgradable vehicles. Another engine. Oh, oh, I'm pretty sure I don't have that. Is that how easy it is? Speedy Reindeer Dacia. I'm pretty sure after that, I have every single one of these OG upgradable skins. Okay, so is there any event in the game? Because there, ha there had to have been an event the last time to be able to upgrade your stuff. Oh, real quick, if you guys are watching this right now, if you guys go and find my ID, please, I'll give you guys my ID in a second. Send me some popularity. I did not stream, I didn't make any content, but I, I lost the last popularity battle and it, I could have won it so easily. So if you guys wanna go help me out, um, I think if we go to my ID here, it is 511-850712. How do I upgrade it now? This, these engine cores, oh, wait. They changed it. They changed these upgrade things. Cause I have, this is brand spanking new. Okay, so a long time ago, the only vehicles you could upgrade was this motorcycle and this vehicle. I upgraded it to level five. And when you upgrade it all the way from level one, it looks like this. It's like, oh, your vehicle color can change. But then this is what level, the max level of it, level eight looks like. You can change the seats. You can change the colors. The There's a lot of things you can modify. Same with the motorcycle. And it can also be maxed out. Um, but I have this one maxed out. Now it looks like you can actually use these engines to max out these old skins. I have all the skins, um, which is kind of cool. Basic appearance, it just looks like this. Advanced form, and then the final form. This is cool. Maybe, I don't even know, I, it just, I don't understand why they re-released it, but I guess they changed this vehicle mod system. Maybe, let me see, if anybody really wants to upgrade those, I think the best way to get them might, mm, it might be going after this. Look, my luck meter is actually up a little bit on these ones, but there's no point of opening these ones that's so weird. I've never seen them add something like this before. I was wondering why they added the engines. And I'm, I'm assuming when you get a duplicate, it gives you like engines or something. So it looks like they reworked these vehicle skins, which is kind of crazy. Anyways, that's all I wanted to do. I wanted to get one and I got the one that I was missing. So now let's just get the 40 opening, see if we get any of these legendaries for the uh, esports crates because they're kind of cheap. Oh, oh, I was about to say the. Okay. That's, that's kind of messed up that they did that. Let's do the skips on these. 225 UC, guarantee reward, got the pro league top. And then this one at the 40th draw, we are guaranteed to get at least one legendary. Let's see what legendary that is. That's kind of funny that they, they reworked that, the upgradable vehicle system. The only one legendary we get is the pro league mask. You know what? Out of all the stuff, I think that that's pretty cool. Masks, helmets, stuff like that, backpacks, I love getting. Definitely weird. Definitely super weird. 
gallery. Wait, what did I... I must have gotten some... I think when I got that... I think I got something really old in the gallery. You can see how old these skins are. Yeah, season 10. Christmas Dacia. Collect. What do I get? 10 paint. I will take 10 paint. Add that to the paint. 400 paint. I need paint. The next thing, the last thing that I wanted to do real quick was actually get, this is the first ever LMG that has a gun shield. It's 1500 UC, but I think it's kind of worth it. It's, you know, I wouldn't want to pay 1500 UC for this, for the magazine or for the stock, because that stock looks ugly or 2000 UC for the 4X. So I don't want any of that stuff. I just want the gun shield because that's pretty fire. Anyways, that's it. I wanted to check out those that new upgradable stuff. It's kind of cool that I got one of them. I'm happy that I was able to get one. Oh no, I want to do the 10 UC. 